Hello everyone. Welcome to this series of tutorials for Arduino beginners created by SunFounder. I'm Jack from the SunFounder education team, and it is my pleasure to open the amazing door of Arduino to you. This course was created for people who have no or very little prior experience with electronics and programming. Whether you are a programming beginner, an electronics enthusiast, an artist, or you are an educator, no matter how much or how little you know about Arduino. In this course, I'm going to help you start your Arduino adventure. And by the end of the course, you'll get a basic knowledge of programming, the principles of some of the most common electronic components, and the ability to make an Arduino project by your own. So, I'm going to take you through it step by step. Have you ever had the experience that you spend a lot of time searching on the internet, and you find a dizzying amount of Arduino videos and tutorials. You take some of these courses and they either presuppose that you know a lot, or they just scratch the surface of Arduino knowledge. Some courses focus on theoretical knowledge and are long-winded and endless, delaying hands-on practice. Some courses focus only on doing projects, but they ignore the most important point, you're just a beginner. Even if you follow along with the project guide, you still don't know much about how the project works. You won't be able to complete the project on your own without the tutorial. So, we decided to make a course, a course that would be organized in such a way that it would cover things that an absolute beginner faces. While creating this course, I've kept in mind what problems I had faced when I started my own journey with Arduino. Try to make it like a course I wish I had watched before. You will learn these three parts of knowledge, programming syntax, electronic circuits, and principles of electronic components, starting from the most basic knowledge of each part. From easy to difficult, you will learn relevant knowledge in practical projects one by one. We promote learning by doing. We believe that theoretical learning without practice is very inefficient. So, we expect you to think hard, be creative, and most of all, practice hard in the process of learning. We are confident that if you stick to this series of courses, you will have a whole new understanding of Arduino. You will no longer be satisfied with just copying and pasting code from other people's projects. You will know how it works and be able to modify the code to suit your needs. You will be able to read the code and understand the meaning behind it. When you get stuck and encounter points you haven't learned it before, you will have enough background knowledge and confidence to learn them on your own. When you have a great idea, you will have a clear idea of how to implement it. Maybe not all the technical details right away, but you will have a clear direction. This series of tutorials will be available to everyone for free. We will be updating at least one lesson per week until the end of this tutorial series. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and get notifications of updates. Now let's start from the most basic foundation. What is Arduino? If you have no idea about Arduino, there are several words I would like to show you. Electronics, design, programming, and even maker. Some of you may think these words are quite far away from us, but in fact they are not far at all because Arduino can take us into the world of programming and help us realize the dream of being a maker. In this video we will learn what is Arduino and what can Arduino do, what is needed to complete an Arduino project, and what is the Arduino IDE. Take it easy. You don't need to remember all the details in this lesson. Grab your notebook and write down what you think is important. First of all, I will give you a brief introduction to Arduino. Arduino is a convenient, flexible, and easy-to-use open-source electronic prototyping platform, including hardware, Arduino boards of various models, and software, Arduino IDE. It is not only suitable for engineers for rapid prototyping, but also artists, designers, and hobbyists, while it is almost a must-have tool for modern makers. Arduino is quite a large system. It has hardware, software, and a very huge online community of people who have never met each other, but are able to work together because of a common hobby. 
Everyone in the Arduino family is using their wisdom, making with their hands, and sharing one great invention after another. Speaking of which, you may have doubts about what Arduino can actually do. Suffice it to say, Arduino will solve all your problems. Technically speaking, Arduino is a programmable logic controller. It is a development board that can be used to create many exciting and creative electronic creations, such as remote-controlled cars, robotic arms, bionic robots, smart homes, etc. Arduino boards are straightforward, simple, and powerful, suitable for students, makers, and even professional programmers. To this day, electronics enthusiasts worldwide continue to develop creative electronic creations based on Arduino development boards. So, what do you need for this course? You need a computer that can run Arduino ID, and Wuno board, and some electronic components. Here I recommend our SunFounder 3-in-1 starter kit. The kit includes an Wuno compatible board, and all the components required for this series of courses. More details are in the video description area. If you have already purchased an Arduino board or other kits, don't worry. The electronic components used in this tutorial are universal and readily available online. The Arduino team has open sourced the Arduino development board. This means that others can manufacture products from Arduino designs. So, there are currently two types of development boards on the market. One is the official development board provided by Arduino, and the other is the compatible development board produced by other companies. Arduino original boards are produced by Arduino Company with Arduino's certification. Compatible development boards for Arduino are assembled and produced by other companies which will be more favorable in terms of price. The Arduino team has done a lot for Arduino, so if you want to support them, Consider buying Arduino original boards on the Arduino website. We recommend purchasing an Arduino Uno R3 board or an compatible board for Arduino Uno R3 for a consistent learning experience in our tutorials. Next, let's learn about the Arduino software, the Arduino IDE. Here is a brief introduction. The Arduino IDE, known as Arduino Integrated Development Environment, provides all the software support needed to complete an Arduino project. It is a programming software specifically designed for Arduino, provided by the Arduino team, that allows us to write programs and upload them to the Arduino board. And this tutorial will be based on the latest version of Arduino IDE, the Arduino IDE 2.0. Arduino IDE 2 was officially launched in September this year, compared to version 1. ID version 2 provides a new user interface and has faster response time and compilation speed. This means that you will have a better programming experience when learning Arduino programming with Arduino IDE 2. Arduino IDE 2 also provides many new features. Let's take a brief look. Autocomplete. While typing, the editor can suggest the autocompletion according to your code. This feature is helpful, but at the beginning, avoid relying on it too much. Dark mode. If your eyes are feeling the strain, you can quickly change settings and switch to dark mode. Arduino Cloud. With Arduino Cloud, you can save your code to the cloud so that you can edit your code from different computers. In app updates. When there is a new update to the Arduino IDE, you can very easily update it directly from within the app. Keeping your Arduino IDE up to date is highly recommended. And we will learn how to install and use it in the next lesson. Well, this concludes the content of this lesson. However, if you find any errors or encounter any problems while studying our tutorials, we sincerely hope you will contact us. Furthermore, any comments and suggestions about this course are welcome. Please give us feedback via this email address, education at sunfounder.com. Again, we will be updating at least one lesson per week until the end of this tutorial series. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and get notifications of updates. If you find our course helpful, please consider purchasing our kit to support us.
In the next lesson, we will start with the installation and setup of the Arduino IDE. A journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. When you see here in this video, it means that you have taken your first step in learning Arduino. Arduino is not that hard. Just keep an open mind and give yourself some confidence. See you in the next video.